Guys, we just got the Summoner's War version 642 update notice. I got to get this out of the way at the very beginning. Come to us. Good job. Thank you for actually paying attention to user feedback. We'll see how impactful some of the modifications that they're planning on making are. But based on some of the things with RTA matchmaking, RTA ranks, it seems like they're actually paying attention to user feedback and actually trying to make changes to things that are broken. I mean, they've noticed, it's hard to not notice that the last season was absolutely broken and the amount of players in Fighter 3 was staggering. It was absolutely ridiculous. It was a 520 point or something like that uh, spread for Fighter 3. So also another thing that I want to mention, I know Childish challenged me. I did already record and start editing that video. I did not publish the video just yet, but I'm going to publish the video after I'm done editing the Childish Challenge video. But I, yeah, I, I already recorded it. So it's definitely got done. I just didn't post it on YouTube, uh, and I didn't finish recording. Uh, I didn't finish editing yet. Anyway, uh, let's get started with some of these uh, balance changes uh, with 6.42. Uh, there's some small things, and then there's a few impactful things, right? So Wind Mage is actually still going to be stacked, but apparently there was an issue when they were balance, uh, when when they were checking uh, the uh, the the buff is that it was buffing his stats all at once very fast so they wanted to limit it to the attack the only change here is that the attack power and defense cannot be increased above 100 percent at once so he's still going to increase his attack and defense up to 300 percent total it's just not going to be all at once uh then we have the hell lady dark hell lady um she has a multi-hit for skill two it's an aoe multi-hit so um it's going to remove beneficial effect with a 30 percent chance instead of a 50 percent chance which is kind of a bummer then you can't really rely on it let's see what let's see what it actually is after the skill ups uh so it might still be pretty effective after the skill ups. actually i don't know i guess the skill ups would be the same i don't think they're really changing the skills but i don't have a dark hell lady so I could ask Beans, I guess. But um, anyway, we have some uh, showing complete battles first function for the quality of life improvement for the battle training ground. It's it's whatever. I don't really care too much about this either way. This is kind of nice. I mean, it's something we don't really need, but it's something I feel like I'm going to use. Is the uh, Summon Monster Sealed Shrine search condition added. And now you can search the monster you wish to find by specifying type, grade, and attribute. Which is just a little nice. If you use this all the time, I find my <laughs> I find that I use... I have so many accounts. <laughs> oh my god, help me. I have so many accounts that I wind up using this, so I probably would use this feature. Uh, this, I don't understand. Can't you already do this, though? Can't you already... Oh, no, no, no. You can't, you can't see all the info. You can, like, tap on it to see... Uh, I, you know what? I never do this, so uh, I guess this is just improved. Uh, then we have the monster. Manage main sub-property settings have been improved so that you can only select the designated property according to the rune slot number. For properties that can occur, that it cannot occur in that number, the list will be disabled in the filter, which I don't really care too much about personally. This is just more quality of life. These are little quality of life improvements. These are just like menu changes and things like that. Like, it's not really too big of a deal for these menu changes. This now we have, so you can see... The, instead of just seeing if it was completed or not completed, you can see, oh, I have to do Summoner's Duty three times total. I already did it once. I already did it twice. I just got to do one more. I just do Unknown Summons. I always do Unknown Summons anyway. Um, but yeah, so that's just a small little improvement. I, f I feel like these are just some of these are fluff improvements. Um, but, you know, if it makes people happy, then it makes people happy. Even if I don't care about it, it matters what everyone else cares uh, about. So, World Arisen is World Arisena. World Arena Season 19 will begin uh, on October 11th. Uh, and then we have Grade Cutoff Line Modification. Guardian Conquer Grade Cutoff Line has been modified. This is a big thing. This is a big thing. So, now Guardian, instead of being 1,700, rank top 2,500, is now rank 3,000, right? So, they're adding another 500 players are going to be actually be able to get into Guardian. Uh, Conquer 3 is going to be, instead of top 3%, it's going to be cut off of rank 12,000. Uh, Conquer 2, instead of top 6%, is going to be cut off of uh, top 30,000. And Conquer 1, instead of top 10%, is going to be rank number 50,000. So this is actually going to fix the <laughs> issues where we had last season. So that this is the biggest thing. This and another thing are the biggest thing from this update. Is, is this, anyone that's been struggling, anyone that was struggling in Fighter 3 last season... I mean, people were like, oh, Bagel, you're wrong. Don't complain. Don't get, don't pedal to Fighter 3 players. They're just garbage. They just need to get good. Like, Comptuous is acknowledging that this is an issue. And, I mean, it was very obvious that this was an issue. So they're actually acknowledging that they're actually working to change things to actually uh, balance out the ranks so that half the community is not in one rank. 
because it's not right. But I can't complain about it because you know they actually they acknowledge the the issue and they're looking and they and they're actually making effort to fix it pretty pretty reasonably, right? I mean, it could have been fixed, earlier, but it's it's fine. It's fine. I'm very happy that they're fixing it. Also, this is a big one: matchmaking improvement. The matchmaking has been improved. Uh, we'll see how like is it really really improved? But um. Matchmaking has been improved in World Arena Ranking Battle, Special League 2v2 Team Battle. You will now be matched with more appropriate opponents. But what does that mean? That's kind of vague on what that means. Improvements have been made so you can find the team members more quickly when matching team members via Quick Battle in 2v2 Team Battle as well. But I'm very <laughs> curious to see. It doesn't really go into too much detail. That's the thing that... But at the very least, they're acknowledging that like, okay, we could have some matchmaking improvements going on here. So these are, I mean, if they're going so gung-ho with RTA, at least they're working on improving RTA. So I got to give them credit. As much as I like the poo-poo on them, but I, come to us, RTA is not an eSport. World Arena is not an eSport. Um, at least they're trying to make it better. So I'm keep giving them credit for making it better. You keep, come to us, you keep making it better, and I will keep giving you credit for making it better. Uh, season reward improvement. This is juicy. Oh my god. I mean, like, it's the, it's a little bit better, but it's just, you know, the Statue of Legend of the, the, the Arena. The Transmog. Wyvern Commander Beast Rider. I'm sorry. What was that? Wyvern... Wyvern Commander Beast Rider. Say, say again, because uh, this looks juicy. Is it just me? <laughs> That's like the one I, Okay. That seems like a really cool Transmog. I can't wait to see what that is. Uh, what, what that actually looks like, like, full. Right, uh, shiny fairy wings looks cool as well. Ride three mushroom brothers. <laughs> oh, three mushroom brothers! I think they're running out of ideas for rides. They look fun. Is that mushroom? What does that mushroom have? Is does he have an orange soda? Does he have a vial of some kind of potion? Does he have what exactly is that? Is it ha hand soap? I don't know what the, the what the dude on top has, but that mushroom dude on top has some something. I don't know. Uh, so yeah, there's also going to be more points for people at the end of the season, which is nice just to get some extra whatever, whatever you need. Um, Tartar's Labyrinth change. These are just small changes. Uh, 2v2 team battle font size changed. Uh, Tartar's battle is going to be Anubis instead of is going to be Magic Knights uh, here. Uh, and then there's going to be there's some bug fixes and rune and artifact free removal will be held. The biggest, the two biggest things, I mean, aside from the Wyvern Commander Beast, I'm really excited to see what that looks like. But the biggest things are matchmaking improvement and rank, RTA ranks. Because that was, I mean, that was, that was just so broken. So uh, it's nice, uh, it's nice that that's actually, and then we get the balance patch too. So Comptuous has definitely, over the past couple weeks, has been putting above average, um, effort into listening to community and trying to address concerns and fix them so thank you come to us again i'm going to give them credit for that and guys i am also working on uh i did do the childish challenge don't worry i am still working on editing that i shouldn't go so crazy with editing these videos i know you guys like you're like yo we want you to go crazy on edit all of them i'm like yeah but then there's no time for other fun things that i other fun videos that i want to do on other channels like food ones. Anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you guys are excited about the RTA changes because I know I am. Uh, that's it for this one. I'll see you as always in the next one.